Our region is no stranger to severe weather, so as tornado season continues and hurricane season approaches, it's better to stay safe than sorry. Tenant Nurse Science Maria Elena Bolores explains how locally based Operation Blessing is joining forces with the Home Depot to help families prepare. Well, Stephanie, they know that when disaster strikes, things can get hectic and you might not have the right supplies. So today, volunteers assembled nearly 800 disaster relief kits with enough supplies to get back on your feet if things go wrong. You're going to see paper towels, trash bags, disinfectant, cleaning supplies, uh, N95 masks, scour pads, and gloves. All things that they can use immediately right now to help get them back on their feet. It starts with a bucket, which quickly fills with supplies, supplies to help instantly after disaster strikes. We're creating kits that are for emergency disaster relief for those in need when something hits catastrophic, such as a tornado, a hurricane, or a flood. Operation Blessing will have these kits warehoused and ready to go as soon as a disaster hits. Therefore, within one day, they can have a response out to the people in need. Today, volunteers with the Home Depot Foundation and Operation Blessing assembled 775 disaster relief kits. So for somebody who's just experienced a flood in their home, that gives them the ability to literally just go in and start cleaning up. The kits will be pre-staged, ready to distribute to families hit hard by storms or other emergencies. It's honestly, it's like a breath of hope. Um, they've just been devastated. They've been through a disaster. So when we're able to come in immediate with something tangible that they can grab a hold of and start going towards recovery, I mean, it means so much. All of the volunteers I spoke with today said they were happy to give back and potentially help a neighbor. We'll share information on both organizations over on wavy.com. I'm Maria Elena Balores. Ten on your side.